Instagram just rolled out a new feature to a bunch of its users that is censoring certain types of content from showing up on Instagram, both in the explore page and in your main feed. This feature is in a ton of regions and its default setting is to be on, limiting certain content from showing up. And the parameters that they give for which content will be restricted is content that is upsetting or offensive. And like I said, the natural default position of this setting is to be turned on. And I wasn't aware of the setting. I found out about it in from a third party source. So I wanted to make this video to bring it to your attention, allow you to find where this setting is within your profile and allow you to either leave it as is, turn it on or turn it off. So let's hop right into my phone and walk through how you can find this. And all that I ask for in return for keeping you informed is a quick little tap that like button and we'll be even. So we're hopping into my phone right now, as you can see right here, we're at my profile. To find this setting for yourself, very simple, go to your profile and then click the little burger icon in the top right here. And then from here, we're gonna click settings. And then from here, we're gonna click account. And then here to find the new setting, if you have it, is sensitive content control. I had never seen that before, before I heard about it from this third party source. So we tap into here, it shows you that the default setting is on limit. And what that means is you may see some photos and videos that could be upsetting or offensive, but it's going to limit certain things to a degree. You can limit even more, which is gonna be even further restrictive, or you can allow yourself to be subjected to the content that Instagram deems to be upsetting or offensive. Personally, I'm gonna turn mine on to allow because I'm not easily triggered and I would rather make the decision myself as to what's upsetting or offensive and then restrict my consumption from there. But I just wanted to bring this to your attention because I wasn't aware of it before, so I'm sure a ton of you aren't aware as well. So this is how you find the new sensitive content control feature if you have access to it in your region. And then once in here, you can decide to either leave it as the default, which is limit, limit it even further, or you can allow yourself to see that kind of content. Whatever you wanna do, that's completely up to you. This new feature is likely a response to the racism that happened after the Euro finals. And if this feature can eliminate or reduce the amount of racism on Instagram, I'm all for that. I think we can all agree that there is no place for racism. It's disgusting. And if this is limiting that, then fantastic. I'm more for these features to get rid of racism. But the words upsetting or offensive, that's a slippery slope that could mean so many different things. It's very, very open-ended. That's why I personally will leave it on allow because I would like to make that decision for myself because who knows, especially in today's day and age, what's upsetting or offensive. For one person, it could be no problem. And then for someone else, it could be upsetting or offensive. So you do what you want. That's totally cool. I, I like that they give us the option, but I just wanted to bring it to your attention that it's there. I would also love to hear from you. What are your opinions on this new feature? Do you like it? Do you love it? Do you hate it? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And if you want to stay up to date with all things social media and grow on social media and make money while doing it, don't forget to subscribe to this channel right here. My name is Ben and I make weekly videos to help you do that. Don't go anywhere. Two more videos are about to pop up that I guarantee you will like. So I'll see you over there. Peace.